Hi. I've noticed a lot of commenters seem to think Ani doesn't have a lot of toys. Oh my goodness, look. Oh, I love redneck film. Oh, hell yes. Yeah, boy. What do you think, Ani? Is that not awesome? I wish you could ride one. Okay, so anyway, back to Ani. This is his playroom for stimulation. He's going to have this big TV with birds on it. All his mail's going on the walls. We have clouds and a big tree um, decal going on there. We're going to have a sofa. And we are going to throw toys everywhere. Um, he does have toys. He does have foraging things. He has all organic, natural foods for little birds and big birds. He gets fresh foods, fruits, and pastas, and look, toys. <laughs> it's just that I don't have everything out all at once because I used to do that, and he ignored everything and got into a lot of trouble. So... Instead, I just have a few out at a time and keep switching them out. Are you looking for the redneck boys again? Huh? Guess what? I'm a hillbilly in training because I have an ATV too. Yeah. I wish you could ride it and go places with us. Speaking of which, I don't know if you've seen my videos, but... These are all his diaper bags and backpacks. He goes out wherever we go, basically. I call this his baby seat. This is what goes in the car with us. And there's toys and shredders and food and water in it. More toys and supplies. This is for the little birds, too. And there's his Mayhem Monday mailbox. So every Monday he gets a goodie in there. I try to record most of them. More supplies. And he hangs out here when we do stuff. And he has showers every few days. They keep that, him nice and calm and his feathers in great shape. Toys, shredding, puzzles, music. All different kinds of textures. Oops. Uh-oh, it's not playing. He must have shut it off. Because he's smart that way. Yo. Pumpkin. <laughs> we never did open that for him. I've got to. We're just so busy. Window um, ledge that we've let him destroy. And this is where he spends a lot of time. Giant cage, shredding things, things for him to mouth of every material you can imagine, including seashells. Toys, bells, um, it's just he, just he takes them apart in no time. If we go out, we assemble these all back and put them back up, boing. Fresh foods, pastas, nuts, um, vegetables, and fruits, though we have to go grocery shopping <laughs> here, which I need plenty of. Minions. <laughs> Hang out. So, yeah, if you're a newcomer to Ani's World, don't worry. Um. I really have enough Shredder's Puzzle toys to keep him occupied. He's not, I'm not like, I mean, it's hard to keep up. Toys are really expensive. And so I try to keep up and give him regular stuff like boxes and everything. Just household things for him to dig at. But don't worry, believe me, he's well spoiled. I do know if he bites to say no and make a face. 
I do know to turn my back and leave him for a minute. More rednecks. Here they come. Woohoo! Yeah. Look at that. Oh, I wish I knew how to do that. What do you think, Ani? Huh? It's quiet in here. Uh, which reminds me, like I said, this is on. And usually, this is on, angle towards him. The baby channel is 293. So, yeah. There's Alexa. Hi, Alexa. Alexa, hi. Hello. So, yeah. Wonderful world of life, believe me, okay? Um, that all said, I really appreciate and thank people for, um, they take so much time typing out help. And I appreciate that so much because I know that takes a lot of time and they care about Ani. And I'm so happy about that and thankful. And that's fine to keep it coming. I need it because I don't think of everything. And then I forget things. And it's always helpful to see everything in print to go over. I just wanted to reassure people that watch that he's good. High five? No? Also, yes, his wings are trimmed. They're growing back. It looks severe. It is not. He can fly. Okay? It's growing back because I want an even milder clip. But he can fly across rims and things. He even, we got him on recall. This one looks better. But yeah, um, I prefer to have him clipped because I'm terrified that he'll accidentally get out one day. I mean, if they live 70 more years, you can't tell me there's no risk that a stranger or somebody will come in or you will even be robbed or a kid comes in and he might get out. I don't want him flying. 10,000 miles non-stop so that I can never find him again and meet a certain slow, torturous death. I'm not saying clip all wings. Every bird is different. Every situation is different. The Sonny the Cockatiel has a full clip. Because when he's scared, he will smash into windows and such. He also almost died on a stovetop because he was flying around the house. Little Pip, full flighted. Because he's never once gotten in trouble. We've had him over 10 years. There's even an invisible barrier he seems to think there is, and he won't go beyond it. Everybody has a different situation, and everybody has their opinion, and I realize I may be wrong. This isn't because I felt like I owed people an explanation. Really. This is because I know people really care about him. And I don't want them to worry. I want them to see the videos and just be really happy for what they are. Okay? Happy Sunday.